Looking at how to find the correct working end for the Barnhart 5-6 instrument in the posterior regions. The best way to do this is to fulcrum on a premolar, place the instrument interproximal in the molar area, and pay attention to the lower shank. The lower shank should be parallel to the long axis of the tooth. You can also say that the functional shank should go up and over the tooth. You always want to look at both ends before you decide which is correct. You can see that this end, the lower shank is perpendicular to the long axis of the tooth, therefore this is the correct end, and this is the five end working on the buccal surfaces of quad four. You can say that this will also be the same end for toward surfaces, so buccal of quad four, lingual of quad three, you will need to switch ends for the away surfaces, buccal of quad three, and lingual of quad four. Looking at the correct working end in the maxillary, posterior quads next. Again, fulcruming on a premolar, placing the instrument in that interproximal molar region, and checking to see which end, the lower shank, is parallel to the long axis of the tooth. This is the correct end. This is the six end. So six is the correct end for buccal of quad one and lingual of quad two, those towards surfaces and you will use the opposite for buccal of quad two and lingual of quad one.